I am here today to share a bit about our fireplace and mantle setup. That is my daughter in the background. This is basically the full setup. There's my little pup. There's my troublemaker. But back to the mantle. Here it is. And uh, let's just go in for a closer look and I will tell you what I do and why. So number one, you have to make sure that you have varying heights for everything. So you can see we have a tall candlestick right there, uh, different shapes overall. And if you have shorter things, try and stack them on top of decorative boxes, things like that. Um, most of these things, I'm probably gonna get questions on where I got what. I cannot remember exactly what I got where, but I know this sign we got from Michael's. Most of the stuff is from Michael's, Home Sense, Home Outfitters. Here I'm standing on our coffee table to give you a better look. Here are stockings. We have a full rustic theme in our house. These trees right here and right there are from Michael's as well. I got this poinsettia actually, it's a real one from Real Canadian Superstore. And that sign right there, we paralleled with that sign over here to give you this full, full look. Ugh, not very good at handling this just yet. But um, that's right. So different heights. So you have tall, lean things like the nutcracker. You have tall, fuller things like the poinsettias. And then we, you know, you have this lantern here. We love candles. So that's one. And then we have other ones here at varying heights. And I like putting in a garland because garlands really help to fill the gap and give the whole mantle some cohesiveness. And I think with a rustic look, it's nice to have it more full. There's other styles that I think you can do a bit more minimalistic, but I think the really full look works with the rustic woodland old school Christmas. Um, so for filler, we have the garland, which of course has, you know, different berries and some pine cone, but we also fill areas with moss and you can use fake snow as well. We have pine cones as well as fillers. Then as I mentioned, we have the stockings, our trees, and then over on our main couch, you will see that we have a few pillowcases and a Christmas throw that I got at HomeSense. And I'm just gonna give a quick tour of our TV stand area. We don't have really too much decor here. We just have this berry branch at the top. I think if you add some tinsel or some lights across the top, it could be gorgeous. And this is me just showing off our Santa photos with my kids. Um, get them done every year. That was the first one of both of them last year. I have yet to um, frame their one from this year, which is why we have the stock photo here. So maybe if I post a photo or a video next year, you will see it all come together. But anyways, hope you enjoyed. Please uh, leave a thumbs up, a comment, and subscribe. Can you say subscribe? Say please subscribe to Amma's channel. Can you give a flying kiss? Yeah. Thank you. Mina, can you say Merry Christmas?